All right, welcome back to Pharmacist on Call. Your host, Dr. Sean Pruitt. Your doctors are busy, your pharmacists are busy. They don't have time. But this hour, I do. So call in with your questions and your comments. So we're going to get right back into your calls. Looks like we've got Peggy. Peggy, welcome to Pharmacist on Call. How may I help you? Uh, yes, I was checking to see what you would recommend for my nearest disease and the ringing in your ears. Uh, I would probably recommend there is a supplement called... Well, a couple of things. Um, lipopolysaccharide, I believe is what it's called. And the only place I've seen it is in uh, Kroger. I hate to be giving them a plug. Uh, but look, uh -huh. look right in front of their pharmacy. It's in a maroon box. It's about about the size of a, a box of camphophenique, something like that. But it's called lipo okay. lipopolysaccharide. No, no, sorry. Lipoflavonoid. So that's the name oh, of it. Oh, okay. And then the other thing uh, is our CBD hemp oil. Okay. Which I did not put up here, uh, but that also helps. Uh, that should help you with the tinnitus as well. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. And, and what about uh, like uh, macular degeneration? Macular degeneration, I think lutein is supposed to prevent that. Um, maybe, maybe CBD hemp, but I think lutein is the primary thing that you want to be taking. L U T E I N. L U T I N. L U T E I N, uh huh. E I N. Yes, okay. ma'am. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you so much. Yes, ma'am. All right. Thank you. Mm, bye bye. All righty. Bye bye. Okay, so uh, when we, uh, during the break, I had uh, kind of went on a little diatribe here, and I was talking about with regards to the potion, for those of you uh, who are a little hesitant about the vaccine or unvaccinated, you're going to need to do something, and so you can't walk around expecting that nothing's going to happen to you. Boost your immune system if you're not going to do the vaccine. Uh, just handle it naturally. You know, you got you to gotta do something. You've got to boost up your interferon. And you can't do it doing nothing. You've got to boost up your antibody production. You've got to thin your blood out so that it doesn't clot. You know, so this is what I recommend for those of you with uh, vaccine hesitancy, as they've uh, called it, or for those of you who have been vaccinated and you're having side effects that are lingering, this right here will take care of it. So prevention and treatment. All right, so uh, in that same thing, uh, we want to, we have something that we can take, uh, but we also want to kind of prime our bodies for combating disease. And so, okay, it looks like we've got a caller here. You all call and remind me what I was getting ready to say. Pharmacists, how, pharmacists don't call. Let me help you. Uh, this is our uh, brother Chiz. I was trying to ask him about, I've been having uh, like my sinus and all this stuff, and I've been having like, uh, like chest, uh, you know, like. Are you coughing up flames, sir? Like, yeah, 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 you know, but it, it was yellow, but now it's white. Okay. okay. Me and him went to school together. You and who? Me and, uh, me and him, me and me, uh, Sean Pruitt. Did, he go, did you go to uh, Holland Heights? Yeah, yeah, I did. What's your name? And, 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 yeah, one of the shoes. Wendell Shields. You both was at Derrick Curls back then. Well, yeah, you went to school with me then. Yeah, y'all, I had a <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice you, know, you need to stop by the pharmacy, man, so I can see you. What, 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 what kind of uh, stuff that you got for, you know, like, I don't know if I got a touch of it or what. So, all right, so you coughing up something that's gone to, uh, is it clear or white? It's clear, it's, it's, it's turning clear now. Okay. But my nose keep on running. And my, my chest is congested. When does it hit you? When you sleep at night or in the when I wake up in the, when I wake up in the morning, that one start bothering me. When I'm asleep, it don't bother me. Okay. When is the last time you changed your air filters? Uh I change them uh every month. Okay. I probably change them more than that though. Okay, okay. Then it sounds like you may have had a a sinus infection. Uh so that you know, is your throat sore too? No, my, my throat not so, but I have coughs too. Mm. But you probably take it. Yeah, I, like Mucinex and stuff like that. Mucinex DM, uh huh. But you also need something. You know, it makes me sleep good. You know, I take the nighttime, then I take daytime. And yeah. Now, um, how.
how are you functioning when you own the medicine? It dries it up and everything? It dries it up for a little while. Okay. How many times a day are you taking it? Um, probably once. Okay. You probably need to... Uh, I, I, I use it to, to, you know, go to sleep, and uh, and it, it kind of dries it up. Then when I wake up, that's when I have all the cough, and then, uh, you know, like, uh, rest it in your chest. Okay. Then you may need to go on and get you just some um, some straight Mucinex DM without the nighttime in it. Oh, okay. Now, what about that stuff you just showing me? This, you know what? Now that you mention it, uh, one of the main uh, uh, comments that everybody came in and said was that their allergies and their sinuses went away yeah. once they started taking it. So yeah, I would recommend this. Yeah, good point. Yeah, I didn't think about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just to what I'm trying to do. Yeah, allergies and sinuses too, y'all. What's that, the small bottle or the big bottle? Yeah, this is the big boy right here. It's eight ounces, so uh, it's uh, $39.99. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'll be down there because I buy water from you, too. Okay. I told you, I, I said when me and you went to school together, though. Okay. <laughs> well, then I <laughs> make sure you but tell me you come in and tell me who I... you are. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember you made most of us had long dairy curls. Yeah, 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 man. <laughs> A nice crisp dairy curl. Yeah. <laughs> But God bless you, brother. All right, you too, man. All right, appreciate but, you coming. Uh, okay, wait, man. What's the, what's the name of that, though? Dr. Pruitt's Dr. Potion. Dr. Pruitt's Potion. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I got you then, brother. Yeah, as God soon as you come you, in, man. it's it's right behind it's right yeah, behind the cashier. you know me. Yeah, yeah I know mm -hmm. you, man. Yes, you sir. already know what I'm talking about, Holly Heights. Yes, sir. The Maplewood. You went to Maplewood, too. Go Panthers, yes, sir. Absolutely. Uh, yes, Class sir. of 88. Yeah, Maplewood. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I ain't going to hold you up. I'm taking too much time from you. Okay. Hey, I appreciate the call. God bless you. All right, you too. I'm going to come down and, and, and get some of that. Okay. All right. We look forward to seeing you then. Okay, then. All right. God bless you. All right. All right. Highland Heights Hornets, Maplewood Panthers, where you at? Okay, so... um uh, we were getting ready to discuss uh, how we kind of prime our bodies uh, to keep ourselves cool during this COVID-19 season. Uh, as you've heard, disease begins in the gut. And so what we want to do is kind of cleanse that out, cleanse out the old fecal matter, uh, all of that uh, uh, diseased fecal matter that kind of stays, especially for those of us who don't drink a lot of water. We have something called CKLS, and this is our colon cleansing uh, kidney cleansing, liver and spleen cleanser. And this is about a 10 herb combination that scrapes the walls of the colon. But it looks like we've got another call here. So we're gonna hang on. Michael, welcome to Pharmacist on Call. Let me help you. How you doing? Hey, pretty good, how are you? Where are you located at on Dixon Road? Right next to Z-Mart, right by Last Chance Liquor Store. The, the okay, former. cause I got a few, uh, she had like these problems, she said, in her legs mm -hmm. and her toes go numb and stuff. Mm -hmm. She diabetic? And, uh, no, she ain't no diabetic. She just said it, it's like uh, in her legs sometimes, uh, they'll shoot pain down in and then uh, okay. it, uh, it, a big toe or something will get uh, numb. Yes, sir. And yeah. tingling. Yeah, it sounds like neuropathy. Has she had back problems? Yeah. I'm not for sure. Well, just tell her to come on down to the pharmacy and we'll give her a sample of something to help her out. Okay. Uh, yeah, I was just on, I seen you on TV. I was looking at you and I was talking mm -hmm. to you on the phone. I said, there you go right there. I said, I see Mr. Curry and I couldn't make out the other name. And that man who was talking to you said, your name Charles. And y'all got that Aperlion water, right? We absolutely do. Yes, we do. The $2 best Aperlion water. Yeah, yeah. Two dollars for refill, four dollars for a brand new one. Oh, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sir. Yeah, thank you. But yeah, bring her on by and uh, we'll give her a sample of something to help her out. Okay, thank you. All right, thank you. Okay. All right. So, looks like we got another one here. Mary, welcome okay. to Pharmacist on Call. Let me help you. Okay. Hello, Mary? Uh, yes. Welcome to Pharmacist on Call. How may I help you? Uh, yes, uh, I'm calling about, uh, I have uh, a problem with the arthritis. Yes, ma'am. Real bad. What's going on? Uh, stiffness. Yeah, stiffness, real bad. You have and real bad I stiffness? Take, uh, uh, medication, pain medication, but don't move the stiffness. Okay, what, what pain medication are you taking? 
the uh oh uh 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 it's uh mixed with uh with Tylenol. Okay, okay. Uh, I, I was cut off. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, that but one. That won't really help with uh, with the stiffness and the joint pain. So I would, uh, yeah, you can take something like uh, either turmeric or our CBD hemp oil, and those two would help with that stiffness a little better than the oxycodone. Because it, it's not good for inflammation, but those two products I mentioned are good for inflammation. Okay, uh, the turmeric and what else? Uh, the hemp oil, CBD oil. Okay. Hemp oil. Yeah, it's CBD. It's CBD. It's CBD. Uh, in fact, uh, just stop by the pharmacy. We'll give you a sample of it. Uh, probably, preferably in the morning when you're stiff, and then we'll see if mm -hmm. it helps you out. Okay. All right. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> All right. Bye bye. Okay. All right. We've got one more here. Donna, welcome to Pharmacist on Call. May I help you? Hi, uh, my name is Donna, and I suffer from real bad migraines. Okay. All right, so uh, what are you taking for them? Uh, I take uh, Topiramate, but it really doesn't help. Okay. I want to take something that's more natural. Okay, two things. Uh, let's start magnesium. Uh, so I think it's magnesium oxide, either four or 500 milligrams. Uh, you can do those okay. uh, once or twice a day, and those are good for preventing migraines. And then uh, our CBD hemp oil has worked really well with migraines. So if you okay. just happen to have one, man, stop by the pharmacy, and we can knock it out quickly for you. Okay. Yeah. Um, where are you located? I've never been there. Uh, we are on Dickerson Road. Where are you coming from? Uh, no, I'm still right. No, it's a pike. So we're one mile so from Titan Stadium on Dickerson Road, but going away from the stadium. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Right. Sounds right. Yeah, so 8 Thank you so much. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, stop by for a free sample. Okay. Oh, great. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. All right, bye-bye. All right, everyone, we're up on another break. Stay right there. We'll be right back.